find the differential equation given the general solution. So in this case, our solution has the form y equals c1 e to the alpha x cosine beta x plus c2 e to the alpha x sine beta x. And we can see from this that here we really have an e to the 0x. Likewise, here we have an e to the 0x. So in our case, alpha is equal to 0 and beta is equal to 6. And this solution here arises from roots of the form alpha plus or minus beta i. So we have 0 plus or minus 6i, so plus or minus 6i. So these guys are the roots of the characteristic equation. So now we can go ahead and write down the characteristic equation. We know that 6i and minus 6i are roots. That means that m minus 6i and m minus negative 6i are factors of the characteristic equation. So this is m minus 6i, m plus 6i, and this is equal to 0. Now recall if you have a minus bi times a plus bi, this is equal to a squared plus b squared. So in this case, it's simply m squared plus 6 squared equals 0. So that gives us m squared plus 36 equals 0. And now we can finish. Because we have a 2, this is y double prime, and then plus, and then there's no m here, so we just put a y. And that's it.